everyone it's Erica with Craftinated and today I'm going to be setting up the next month in my A5 Blackout Archer and Olive. Um, it will be the last month in this journal. I will be so sad to see this one go. It's been so much fun being in the blackout. I absolutely love it. I will be going to a different journal um, for the next six months of the year but just a side-by-side -side comparison this is another journal. Look at that. It is like so thick and chunky, <laughs> but um, it just shows that these can kind of expand, but it, you know, it does, it does look like it's been used. It's a little worn. So um, for the last month in this, I'm going to be doing the Pumpkin King um, by Savannah Paper Co. And I really wanted to do this in blackout. I know it's not Halloween, but these colors, it just... I just have to use it in the blackout because I'm not going to be in the blackout uh, when Halloween does roll around. So um, love these colors, bright pinks, purple, blue, yellow. I am in love with this. So I have the PP Weeks. I have the full kit and it's kind of all kind of together here. This is the full kit. Oh, this is the monthly kit. So I have the, I have the, B, I have the B6 or PP Weeks. I have the full monthly kit, I have the regular kit, and then I also have these scallop add-on boxes. So I have a lot of materials to use for this one. And then I went through my swatch book, and let me show you this. This is So this, these are the colors that I picked out, and I was using these smiley faces, or skulls, or whatever. So I went through and I said, okay, that one looks pretty close to the blue, and that's the pool blue. And then, okay, this one looks good for the yellow. That is the orange yellow. These are, those are both tropical. And then this, I have the Quest Magenta. And that was from the sub box. And I feel like that's pretty close to the pink. It's, it's as hot as it's gonna get, I think. And it's kind of close to the purple too. So it kind of works. I'm not gonna use another one because I feel like the pink and the purple are so close and that I didn't really have anything that would kind of match with that. So, I'm gonna do, I'm gonna speed it up, put it to music, do a real quick flip through, um, and then we'll come back and we'll uh, get started on June. All right, so that brings us back to my June cover page. Um, I'll be working on that first. I'm not really, I kind of know what I wanna do, but I'm also kind of unsure what I'm, where I'm gonna go with this, so. It'll be interesting to watch, I think. <laughs> so I'm gonna get started on this and let me know in the comments below, like would you wanna see like a full flip through of my entire bullet journal? I will have to block out some areas, but I could potentially do that um, once I'm done with June and coming back to work on my new setup for the next six months in my July. So let me know if that's something that you would be interested in. And as always, I, um, I'm an affiliate for Archer and Olive, so you can use my code CRAFTINATED10. Um, that is an affiliate code, so when you use that, I do get an incentive, and it will save you 10%. And then with um, Savannah Paper Co., you can use my code ERICA20, and that will get you 20% off and also my freebie. So I'm going to go ahead and get started. We'll put this to music, and we'll come back at the end for a flip through.
So that was the making of for my June. I love the way it turned out. So we'll just do a real quick flip through. This thing is so thick. I know it's because I use stickers a lot of the times, but it's really thick. All right, so we have the cover page. Um, it has zero on there from Nightmare Before Christmas. And it says here, dearest friend, if you don't mind, I'd like to join you by your side where we can gaze into the stars and sit together now and forever for it's plain as anyone can see we're simply meant to be. And that's a quote from the movie. Uh, and then here it says, oh, there's an empty place in my bones that calls out for something unknown. And everything I put in this month, like all the quotes are from um, the movie. And this is water, eat well, steps, creative, YouTube, Instagram, journal, family, no spend. And then my goals, mini goals with results, one through eight that align with my level 10 uh, life goals. And I will put in what my goals are and then what the results are once I complete those or or lack thereof completing. Um, this page I really like. I left it pretty blank. Lots of glitter black washi around the edges. And it says my skull's so full it's tearing me apart. I thought that was kind of good for like a brain dump. So that's why I put that there. Uh, this one is just... There's really not much text on here, just the days of the week, June, to-do list, to buy, and then just some uh, stickers to de decorate it. Um, I like these ones because you can actually like write in them and have like little sticky notes there, so that's why I put those down there. I kind of left this one sc like scripts free. I'm going to probably put them in as I go, but I just didn't um, feel like putting them in right now. <laughs> to-do, important, uh, days of the week important for both of these little bubbles down here and June. So then these I'll do on my live plan with me's except for I think that Kay's out of town one of these and then I'm out of town one. So I don't know how we're going to do it. I may just um, post the pictures on Instagram when I complete it. And then my quarter review, goals completed, still need work, biggest successes, biggest difficulties, things that stand out, what's next, lessons learned, and this month on a scale from zero to, or from one to ten, and then back here is my um, my meal planner that I use for uh, the entire six months and my pen test, and then that's it. Like that, this is the end of the book. So um, I'll be looking to starting my next journal here shortly. I think I'm gonna use the white one that I got from Archer and Olive. I go back and forth on it all the time because it is such a special journal, um, but I really want to use it and I feel like I feel like they're journals and they're meant to be used and the only value you put on them is like the value that we put on them and I know it's like limited edition or whatever but at the end of the day it, that's what its purpose is and I'm never going to sell it anyhow so <laughs> uh, or get rid of it so I might as well use it. So I think I will use it. I still have a couple of days to decide because I'll need to start sketching out um, the next six months and how I want to set that up. I think I'm going to do things a little bit differently uh, the next six months but we'll see where I go. Um, so let me know what you guys think about this in the comments below. I know it's not Halloween, but I just was really feeling this in my blackout in the last month. So thank you guys so much for watching. And as always, you can follow me um, here, subscribe to my channel, and you can follow me on TikTok, Instagram, and Facebook. Thank you guys so much for watching, and I hope you have a wonderful day. Bye.